The Bharat Jodi Yatra has entered its last leg day after twin blasts rocked a busy locality in Jammu, which left nine people injured. Senior Congress leader Jairam Ramesh said there will be no compromise on the security of Rahul Gandhi, who is in fact heading the Bharat Jodo Yatra in Jammu and Kashmir. The Yatra is passing through Samba, the same area where the blast took place on Saturday for about 1.25 kilometers. Meanwhile, hinting at a conspiracy behind the twin blasts, Ramesh expresses doubt on whether the blasts were done to stop the Yatra, claiming that nothing is going to be able to stop the Bharat Jodo Yatra. He said that he hopes the Jammu and Kashmir administration will take care of the security arrangements. Union Defence Minister Rajnath Singh has also raised questions on the Yatra, questioning whether the country was not united. Rajnath accused Gandhi of maligning India's image. The minister said that India is being defamed by those who say there is hatred in the country. I would like to say to Rahul Ji, and I would like to say to Congress, Rajnath, केवल सरकार बनाने के लिए नहीं की जानी चाहिए राजनीति की जानी चाहिए तो समाज बनाने के लिए राजनीति की जानी चाहिए देश बनाने के लिए राजनीति की जानी चाहिए भारत की प्रतिष्ठा भारत की आन बान शान के साथ राहुल गांधी जी खिलवाड़ मत करो भारत को अंतर्राष्ट्रीय जगत में बदनाम करने की कोशिश मत करो कल दो बम ब्लास्ट हुए क्या ये भारत जोड़ो यात्रा को रोकने के लिए किया गया हम नहीं कह सकते ये खुफिया एजेंसी और सिक्योरिटी एजेंसी ही बता पा रही है पर हमें विश्वास है कि अब तक जो हमें सहयोग मिला है प्रशासन से खास तौर से यहाँ के एलजी से उनके सलाहकारों से सुरक्षा बलों से वो बरकरार रहेगा कल दिग्विजय सिंह जी और मैं डिस्ट्रिक्ट अस्पताल भी गए थे गवर्नमेंट मेडिकल कॉलेज के अस्पताल में गए थे आ, जो घायल हुए हैं उनसे हमने बातचीत की हम उस जगह जहां बम बम विस्फोट हुआ था आ, उस जगह से करीब डेढ़ किलोमीटर की दूरी से गुजर रहे हैं आज सांबा जिले से जम्मू जिले तक तो जा रहे हैं आज सुबह तो कार्रवाई तो कर रहे हैं Sunil Ji Bhatt is getting us more details on the story. Joining us from Jammu, Sunil, this has taken uh, an interesting political turn of sorts with the Congress, in fact, hinting at the fact that perhaps all of this was orchestrated to prevent Gandhi from carrying out the yatra successfully in this region. Absolutely, Sneha, mm -hmm. politics, uh, you know, is playing out over this, uh, you know, issue of terrorism here in Jammu and Kashmir. And the Congress party is saying that it is a responsibility of the JNK administration to provide foolproof security for Rahul Gandhi, Bharat Jodo Yatra. They are saying that they are cooperating with the authorities. They are adhering to all the, uh, you know, guidelines that are being issued by the uh, government. And they are not violating any kind of protocol, but they have raised questions that how, uh, you know, despite the high alert, why have terror attacks taken place uh, in Jammu city? So they have raised concern over this and they have asked the government to provide adequate security to Rahul Gandhi during his stay here in Jammu and Kashmir. And uh, Sneha Rahul Gandhi is scheduled to address a rally here and he is shortly going to arrive here in Satwari area of Jammu and here he is going to address a rally at around 12.30 p.m. So uh, today, the, I mean, Rahul Gandhi will reach Jammu city after, you know, three days of Yatra from Katwa to Jammu. And the large number of people are expected to reach the rally venue shortly. Sneha. Thank you for the moment, Sunil Ji. But getting us all of those details and that controversy brewing over the blast that took place in Jammu on Saturday.